Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're diving into a common challenge faced by many developers. Our viewer asks, how can I use a protocol property in a conforming class as private when the compiler refuses that? Let's break down the issue. The viewer is trying to implement a protocol with a property, but they want that property to be private in their conforming class. This leads to a conflict with the protocol's requirements. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it and hoping finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and work through to that resolution. Now let's continue on. To address the issue of using a protocol property as private in a conforming class, we need to understand how Swift handles protocol properties. In Swift, when you declare a property in a protocol, it must be accessible to any conforming class. This means you cannot directly make it private. One way to work around this limitation is to use a private backing variable in your class. This allows you to keep the protocol property public while maintaining privacy. Now, let's implement the required method from the protocol. We can use the private variable to perform actions while keeping it hidden from outside access. In summary, by using a private backing variable, we can conform to the protocol while keeping the property private. This approach maintains encapsulation. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To keep properties private in a protocol, create a separate class with a file private access level. This allows the properties to be accessed only within the protocol extension and the implementing class. In the example, the class props has a file private variable x. The protocol protocol x requires a property of type props. The class a implements this protocol and initializes x to 7. The method perform any action on x can modify x and print its value. However, trying to access x directly from an instance of a results in an error due to the file private protection. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. There isn't a one-size-fits-all solution for keeping properties private in Swift, but there are some effective workarounds. One approach is to use a Python-like convention where properties prefixed with an underscore are treated as private. Another method involves creating two separate protocols, one for public access and another for implementation details. In the first solution, you define a protocol with a public property and a private one using an underscore. The implementation class can then manage the private property while exposing the public one. The second solution involves creating two protocols, one for public access and another for the implementation details. This way, you can hide the implementation when using the public protocol.
And that's it, guys. We've gone through, answered your question, I hope, and you found that resolution. Guys, if this helped, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, have a good one.